I've got something very important here. I need everyone to share this with everyone they know, not just here in Melbourne, Victoria, Australia, anywhere around the world. Please, we want everyone, everyone to get involved here. What it's about is, this is a mainstream, uh, news.com.au, coronavirus vaccine, anti-vaxxer fury over Australian government deal. If you don't know, about six hours ago, Prime Sinister uh, Scummo has announced that they've made a deal with the vaccine company, Oxford University, uh, for virtually 25 million vaccines, and it's going to be mandatory, whether it's the end of this year or early next year. But as we all knew all along, it's all about the vaccine, and it's going to be mandatory. So it's great that there's fury here, but I don't want to read this article or watch these idiots. Go down here, and there's a question. The good thing about it is I've already done this on my other channel, so I'm going to do it on the, my backup channels and my PK Music channel, whatever. I've got four channels. I'm going to do this on every one of them. So if you've got more than one channel, don't just do it once. Sign into whatever other channel, every channel you've got, and do this, okay? And you'll be surprised... Being a mainstream, uh, you know, channel, you'd think, uh, because most of the people around are not very smart because they're wearing masks, and even the day before it was mandatory, 90% were wearing masks. So you can guarantee uh, people aren't too bright and they're dying to take the vaccine, especially on mainstream media channels. So anyway, I'm going to take the test. Would you take a COVID-19 vaccine? No. Well, of course I clicked on no. So let's cast my vote. Look at this. And you're not going to believe this. I did this five minutes ago on my other channel. It was 53.47. So even in the few minutes, it's increased by 1%. And that's dropped from 38,878 voters. Five minutes ago, that was under... 38,000, it was 37,900. So a lot of people are getting on this. So you see what's going on. So it's not only that question, we've got another one here. Should the COVID-19 vaccine be mandatory? No. And before I cast my vote, you know, I'd, I'd expect um, more people uh, to take the vaccine. There'll be more people there. And some people who will take the vaccine probably agree it shouldn't be mandatory. So I'm assuming that yes will be a lot less than 46. Well, I know. I've, I've done it before, so I know. It was 60-40 before, 10 minutes ago. No. Cast the vote. 60-40 still. 33,800, a little bit less than uh, 38, about 5,000 less voted here, probably people went there and thought that's all it was, they didn't see there was another question, so look at this isn't it fantastic, we've got 60-40 our way 60-40 our way so like I said, please, please spread this, we have to make this big, if we can get it to 80, 85%, even 90, how good would that be how good will mainstream media see that the supposed minority anti-vaxxers, you know, us evil people who are not anti-vaxxers, we're pro-choices, even the mainstream can see we're not copping this shit. We're not copping this shit because we've got 60, we'll make this 80% are saying no to the vaccine. So no way known that scummo who insisted there must be at least 60% uh, for this vaccine to work, no way known you're going to get 60%. Sorry, mate. You can do any shit you like, but the people are going to be speaking. So please, please, we know in the next months or whatever when this supposed bullshit scummo said it's going to be here by Christmas, whereas this clown here, Federal Health Minister, says, oh, it'll be early next year or even mid-next year. You know, they're all going by the script. They'll drag it on, drag it on, torture us in lockdowns, torture us and begging for the vaccines because that's how they do it. People will be begging for the vaccine to get out of lockdowns and get back to work and get back to school, what have you. But 
Let's just let's just go the no, okay? That's the motto. Go the no. Let's pump the no. Don't be scared to be ridiculed. Don't be scared to admit that, you know, you're an anti-vaxxer. Let them even call you that, even though it's pro-choice. We've got every right. We've got every right to not have that stuck into our arms. Who knows what's in that bullshit? Who knows? We can't trust anyone, especially this piece of garbage uh, calling himself Bill Gates. We can't trust these thugs, psychopaths, whatever you want to call them. So go the no. Spread the word. Go the no. And I want, I'll be checking this every day for how long it goes for. And let's, let's get it. By the end of today, let's get it to 70% and 30. By God, you know. Not only the mainstream media will be seeing this, but you can guarantee uh, the scums like Scummo and Andrews will be seeing it and, and, and the health ministers and, you know. All the way, all the way to the who and Bill Gates. Australia's not going to bend over to this shit. You know, you've dragged this on. You've probably dragged it too far with your lockdowns and you're virtually putting us in a, in a prison. You know, you've gone too far. And people are waking up, hopefully. You know, they're wearing a mask thinking, okay, another couple of weeks, but then no way. You try, you try to extend this stage three, uh, keep it at stage four or even go to stage five. No way we're going to accept that. Just try it. Just try it and see. Because, you know, we've got a, we've got a planned uh, protest on the September the 13th. Check my video I've just made um, only an hour or so ago. Uh, the Facebook page asked for 500,000 people to be there. It's It's been going for 24 hours, and you're not going to believe this. There's already 20,000 people that said either they're coming for sure or interested. 20,000 in 24 hours, and we've still got three and a bit weeks to go before September 13th. They can't do anything when we've got 50,000, 100,000, hopefully. What are the cops going to do? Arrest 100,000 people, find 100,000 people? No way, they'll probably join us and see, and see that we are finally awake to this shit. So anyway, as I said, pass this on to everyone you can. Uh, we got to use every opportunity we can. It's go the no, okay? Go the no. And like I said, if you've got more than one YouTube account, keep, uh, you know, try each one and do the same thing. The more no's we can get, the better. And let's, uh, like I said, hopefully we can get to 70, 80% and wake up these criminals. They can't ignore us. They can't ignore us. We're not a minority. The anti-vaxxers are going to be a majority. By God, they have to be a, major a majority, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and we need we need to wake up everyone because who knows what's in this shit. And we know the urgency to uh, bring out a vaccine within months, but it takes years and years. The urgency to bring out a vaccine against something that doesn't even exist. We're, we're told, go to quarantine for 14 days and this bug just seems to fly out and disappear because then you test negative all of a sudden. So why do you need a vaccine anyway? Why do you need a vaccine? So anyway, we know why. No more rambling on. Get the word out. Go the no.